Hi, my name is Lyra Scout, and this is a brief Wikivids video about Eratosthenes. Eratosthenes of Cyrene, circa 276 BC to 195-194 BC, was a Greek mathematician, geographer, poet, astronomer, and music theorist. He was a man of learning, becoming the chief librarian at the Library of Alexandria. He invented the discipline of geography, including the terminology used today. He is best known for being the first person to calculate the circumference of the Earth, which he did by applying a measuring system using stadia, a standard unit of measure during that time period. His calculation was remarkably accurate. 1700 years after Eratosthenes's death, while Christopher Columbus studied what Eratosthenes had written about the size of the Earth, he chose to believe, based on a map by Toscanelli, that the Earth's circumference was one-third smaller. Had Columbus set sail knowing that Eratosthenes's larger circumference value was more accurate, he would have known that the place where he made landfall was not Asia, but rather the New World. Eratosthenes was also the first to calculate the tilt of the Earth's axis, again with remarkable accuracy. Additionally, he may have accurately calculated the distance from the Earth to the Sun and invented the leap day. He created the first map of the world, incorporating parallels and meridians based on the available geographic knowledge of his era. Eratosthenes was the founder of scientific chronology. He endeavored to revise the dates of the chief literary and political events from the conquest of Troy. Eratosthenes dated the sack of Troy to 1183 BC. In number theory, he introduced the sieve of Eratosthenes, an efficient method of identifying prime numbers. He was a figure of influence in many fields. According to an entry in the Suda, a 10th century reference, his critics scorned him, calling him Beta the second letter of the Greek alphabet, because he always came in second in all of his endeavors. Nonetheless, his devotees nicknamed him Pentathlos after the Olympians who were well-rounded competitors, for he had proven himself to be knowledgeable in every area of learning. Eratosthenes yearned to understand the complexities of the entire world. He was one of the most preeminent scholarly figures of his time, and produced works covering a vast area of knowledge before and during his time at the library. He wrote on many topics, geography, mathematics, philosophy, chronology, literary criticism, grammar, poetry, and even old comedies. Unfortunately, only a few fragments of his works survived the destruction of the Library of Alexandria. Well my friends, I hope you've enjoyed this brief video about Eratosthenes. Until next time, this has been Lyra Scout for Wikivents.